There we go. All the snacks and drinks are ready and waiting. Now we just got to decide on the movie we're going to watch. Oh, do we have to watch that one again? Can't we watch something else? I know it's your favourite, but I wanted to watch something else tonight. W well, what about a romance movie? There are a lot of good ones. R really? Thank you so much. That makes me so happy. Alright, I'll get comfy and you can pick out the movie, seeing as I picked the genre. Wh what are you doing? Surely my shoulder isn't that comfortable. I, I have pillows you could use instead. Nothing's the matter. F fine then, I guess you can rest your head there. Stop smirking at me. I'm not blushing. Can we please just get on with the movie? Thank you. That was really good. What did you think of it? H hello You okay? Ah, you fell asleep. And on my shoulder, no less. God, I wish you could see how cute you look right now. You look so peaceful. I was going to get a drink of water, but now I don't want to disturb you. It makes me so happy that you're able to let your guard down around me and feel comfortable. Everyone at school always says that you're closed off and cold most of the time, but I know the truth. You're just a big, adorable softy. I know I get weird stares at school for hanging out with you, but I don't mind any of them, because I know you'll always be there to help and support me. We may not be the conventional friend duo, but that doesn't matter to me. I love spending time with you and hanging out at school. Like last week, when someone's making fun of me for being small, and you walked right up to them and stared them down for a good two minutes. It made me really happy when you did that. I felt that you actually cared for me. It, it may not be a feeling I'm used to yet, but I really appreciate you giving it to me. When we first met, I thought you were just a tall, scary bully, but since then I've got to see the real you. The you who opens bananas at the bottom because she likes to be different. The you who defends the people you care about fiercely. I got to hear your adorable laugh, and to hear your amazing singing voice. You let me into your life, and I've never felt so welcome. Honestly, I wish moments like this would never end. I would love to tell you all about what I think of you when you're awake. I'm way too shy. I always just end up freezing or getting really flustered and then being able to form any understandable sentences. So, since I've got this chance, I'll take it. I, I love you, you goofball. From the way that you make me laugh to your gorgeous face, I love every part of you. I don't know if I could ever do this for real when you're awake, but I'm glad I at least got to say it to you here. H huh? You are awake? I, 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 no, I'm not, I'm not blushing. How long have you been awake for? The whole time? Then why didn't you say anything? B because you like me too? Are, are you serious? I, I can't believe it. You, you like me back. I'm so happy. Y yeah, we can cuddle if you want to. Well, of course, I want to. Hey, how come you get to be the big spoon? 
I know you're taller than me, but weren't you the one resting on me earlier? You, you want me close? No, that doesn't embarrass me. Like this? Closer? It, is this any better? Ah! Hey, let me go. You're squeezing me too tight. W what? No, of course I enjoy you cuddling me. It's... It's just that I've never cuddled anyone before. So I don't know how to. I'm sorry. I apologised because I don't have enough experience to cuddle you properly. That's better? Why is that better? Because you, you can teach me from scratch that way? Mm-hmm, I'm ready. So I put my head here and wrap my arms around here like this. Th thank you for this, for all of this. I, I never thought that I'd be able to confess to you. I was so worried that it could damage our friendship and cause it to fall apart. I didn't want that. I never want to lose you. You mean the world to me. I love you so much that I can't even begin to explain it. It never even crossed my mind that you could like me too. Well, because I thought you would prefer someone who was better looking or smarter than me to be your partner. You're tall and beautiful, after all. I'm sure you could get any person you wanted. I, I'm perfect like I am? Really? Thank you so much. That means more to me than you'll ever know. Huh? I'm blushing again. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I'm just not used to this stuff. It's making me so flustered. How are you going to fix... Uh, of course that made the blush worse. You... You kissed me. I can't believe it. You actually... Kissed me. I feel like I'm dreaming. Maybe kiss me again to see if I am? N no, this is definitely reality, right? S so, I guess we're together now? You, you wouldn't mind if I laid here and snuggled into you, would you? <laughs> Yay. I've never felt so warm and safe before. Tired? Maybe a little. It is getting pretty late after all. We should probably get up and go to bed. <laughs> I'm so comfy. Uh, are you sure we can sleep here? You might catch a cold. If you say so. I'm just getting a little more comfy. Don't worry, I'll make sure uh, to return the favour some other time.